Hey guys, Pokedan here. You know what I love? I love Pokemon. I mean, I am a Pokemon YouTuber, so that makes perfect sense. But something else I love is memes. I mean, who doesn't? So when you combine both these topics, you get Pokemon memes. And I gotta say, I love Pokemon memes. In these funny pictures, often certain Pokemon are the main topics. And in today's video, I wanted to highlight these hilarious pocket monsters. So today, you've joined me to count down the top 10 iconic meme Pokemon. However, in this video, there are 11 because I thought of too many and I didn't want to get rid of any Pokemon. And, I don't know, top 11 meme Pokemon didn't sound as catchy, so, uh... Get off my case? Look, look, I know I lied in the title, but I'm not a bad guy. Actually, you know what? Screw it. We're, we're not making this video anymore. Uh, I'll see you guys next week. Roll the end card. Uh, okay, maybe I was a bit hasty. But yeah, guys, there were a lot of contenders for this list. So if you can think of any more, be sure to let me know down in the comment section. But with all that being said, let's get started with the video. Pokemon I'll be talking about is Trubbish, and can you guess why it's a meme? Quite often, this Pokemon will be used as an example in those memes about how they just don't make Pokemon like they used to anymore, along with others such as Kling Clang and Vanillux. Of course, Trubbish is always the prime example used. And you know what? I'm sick of it. I love this Poison Boy, so anyone who doesn't, y you can eat my left shoe. It doesn't feel quite right calling the next Pokemon by its official name, but whatever, it's Omanyte. If you're like me, chances are you'll know this Pokemon by a different name, Lord Helix. The Lord Helix memes are olden but golden, and they first started when Red obtained the Helix fossil in Twitch Plays Pokemon. Because it was the first item selected in the bag, whenever the Hive Mind would order Twitch to open the bag, this would be the first item seen. A lot of people fairly assumed that Red was worshipping the fossil, and eventually Omanyte was restored on Cinnabar Island and helped complete the game. We don't see these memes as often anymore, but fair to say, Omanyte has quite a funny name attached to it because of this. Coming in at the number 9 spot is a meme Pokemon I forgot even existed, and it is Esper. Back when Pokemon X and Y were first introducing its roster of Pokemon, fair to say, a lot of people took a shine to this psychic type due to its shocked expression. Naturally, Esper has big eyes, so because of this, the Pokemon was used in memes to show how shocked it looked. As well as this, people played on the fact that its big eyes made it look creepy, often posting things like, I have seen things, terrible things. And guys, the Esper memes are some of my favourites. Next up, we have an evolution line that became famous due to their uncanny resemblance to a well-known figure, being Young Goose and Gumshoes. I'm pretty sure you guys know who this well-known figure is, it's Donald Trump. No matter what your view is on American politics, it's hard to deny that these Pokemon don't look like the United States President. When Young Goose was first revealed, a lot of people were quick to make the comparison, but things only got more obvious when Gumshoes was announced. I mean, just look at these two. It's like looking in an odd Pokemon-themed mirror. Oh, wait for it. Wait for it. Here it is, the Pokemon in at number 7, also known as Alolan Executor. With the Pokemon Sun and Moon games, a new feature was announced that would see some older Pokemon take the spotlight. And of course, this feature was Alolan forms. Many Kanto Pocket Monsters obtained an Alolan form and one of these was Executor. In its Kantonian variation, this Pokemon was always somewhat forgettable, but in Alola it clearly went through a big change because its neck became so long. And of course, because of this, the Pokemon was turned into a damn meme. And you know what, Game Freak? I'm pretty sure you expected this. I mean, if you didn't, 
You should have. Yet another Pokemon that became a meme when first announced was the Grass Starter, Rowlet. And to my knowledge, the only reason it became part of so many memes was because of its design. Fair to say, this starter looks pretty doopy, but it's an adorable doopiness that you'd be mad not to fall in love with. And when it was first revealed, I saw Rowlet feature in so many memes, and you know what? I was all for it. I mean, hey, I agree that Rowlet is a freaking cutie. And I've used it in a few playthroughs too. This meme lord with its grass bow tie was bound to feature in this video. You should have seen it coming. The next Pokemon really shouldn't be on this list because whilst it's here, it's not in the damn bag. Of course, I'm talking about Cosmog. Yet another Sun and Moon meme, this Pokemon became so popular when the games were first released. When everyone played through the games for themselves, there were so many scenes in which Lily commanded Nebby to get in the bag. But of course, being its mischievous self, half the time it was never in its damn jail. Because of how funny these sequences were, it wasn't long before get in the bag was turned into a meme. And a pretty funny one at that. I've seen so many variations of this meme, and I've loved most of them. So, that's that for Cosmog. So, uh, little guy, I'm gonna need you to get back in the bag. At the number 4 spot, we have two Pokemon that are part of the same evolution line. And they are Diglett and Alolan Dugtrio. Both of these Pokemon are on here for different reasons. But since they're related, I thought, heck, i put them together at one spot. Okay, so first off, Diglett has always been a meme Pokemon. And that's because for the longest time, fans have wondered what's underneath it. And often, they've gotten quite creative. As for its Alolan cousin, with gorgeous blonde locks, let's be honest, Alolan Dugtrio was always going to be meme material. So yeah, both of these ground types are on the list because of how meme they are. Moving on. In the top 3 and also in the top percentage overall is the Pokemon Rattata. Just like Lord Helix, this one is olden but golden. And I'd be surprised if there were anyone watching this video who didn't know the origins of this meme. But if by chance you are in this demographic, allow me to explain. In Pokemon Gold and Silver and the remakes, there was a trainer known as Youngster Joey. And basically, Joey was really proud of his Rattata. So much so that he claimed it was in the top percentage. Joey's iconic words made room for so many memes. And it's pretty obvious that because of the memes, Rattata has had quite the boost in popularity. Coming in at the number 2 spot on this list is none other than the Pokemon mascot, it's Pikachu. Are you as surprised as Pikachu that it's at number 2? Yes, that's right, this Pokemon is on here mainly because of the shocked Pikachu meme. Out of all of the memes I've mentioned so far, this is the most recent and I am all for it. I love loading up Twitter or Facebook and seeing different variations of this meme on my feed. I mean, they're all great and I haven't seen a bad version yet. My favourite variation of this meme that I've seen so far is the one where you see the quality of the meme improve with every image. This meme is great, and it's Pokedan approved. And finally, coming in at the number one spot and the memeiest Pokemon out there is Mudkip. I mean, come on. He knew this was coming. There aren't any Pokemon memes out there that are more classic than the So I Heard You Like Mudkips. These days, this meme probably wouldn't get a laugh from many people, but you have to appreciate the old and iconic Pokemon funnies. Personally, I remember being really young seeing this meme and I found it hilarious and to this day, I can't look at a Mudkip without thinking of the iconic meme. There wasn't any Pokemon that would beat Mudkip to the number one spot on this list, this Pokemon has truly earned its crown. But anyway guys, with all that being said, that pretty much wraps things up for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. Also, be sure to let me know about more Mimi Pokemon down in the comment section. 
But with all that being said, for now, I've been Pokedan, you've been amazing, and I'll see you guys next time. Catch your mouth.